Oh, yeah. Pale blood. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. Yarnum is the home of blood ministration. You need only unravel its mystery. But where's an outsider like yourself to begin? Easy, with a bit of yarn and blood of your own. But first, you'll need a contract. Hello there, my friends. Welcome to the channel and a big welcome and thank you for checking out the video. This is my brand new returning to Bloodborne uh series i guess so we're going to play throughout the entire game including the dlc and i'm super excited guys because i adore this game i adore it it's one of the best games ever made <laughs> i really mean that it's incredible now i played this last i think it was um 2023 it could be may or march i, I can't remember i get the two mixed up and it was just a I miss Bloodborne video, so you can check that out anyway. But um, all we did essentially was just play through. I think it was all of Yarnum, and we got up to Father Gascoigne as well. So we defeated him, and then that was the end of the video. I've played many games since, right? So it's now present day. I've just finished um, Horizon Zero Dawn, so that's all completed. And guys, I'm nervous to play this because I will be out of practice. I'm, my memory's not going to be too good in regards to, you know, locations and, you know, whatever. But um, give me time. We'll get there together. <laughs> but um, wish me luck, man, because it's been a while. My goodness, it's been a while. But I'm looking forward to it regardless. And if you're new here, I hope you enjoy yourselves and... Um, this is actually my first entry into a From Software game. So I've since I think I've played um Sekiro. I also did um Elden Ring as well. So we played that. Give me a sec, guys. Let me just put that as Room Bear. So that's my name. Guys, I don't remember this. I'm uh, sorry, let me explain. What I meant was the classes. I don't remember all that. <laughs> guys wish me luck man but i'll try my best to remember look i have played this before many many times but as i said i've had a massive break from this game which is very exciting for me because things will be quite kind of new still if that makes sense so um i want strength and skill is it this one military veteran let's give this a try guys and the reason being I want to use a strength-based weapon, which is probably the saw cleaver anyway. But later, and this is much, much later in the DLC, I want to um, eventually use the beast cutter. I love that weapon, guys. It's awesome. I think that's skill-based, I think. I could be misremembering, but um, I want to get this one anyway. So, military veteran. And appearance-wise. Guys, give me a few minutes. I don't want to waste too much time creating my character, but... um. Let me create my character. I'll be back with you very shortly. Hey, guys. Okay, I tried to make John Wick. <laughs> so this is the nearest thing I can get to John Wick. <laughs> and in fact, guys, let's change our name. I mean, I was going to use Room Bear, but you know what? Let's put... Let's just do it as Keanu. <laughs> Why not? Okay, how do I do capitals again? And how do you spell Keanu? <laughs> so I hope it's this one. All right, let's just do that, guys. That'll do. It's fine. Cool, dude. Oh, oh, and also, what about voice? How do I do voice? Is it this? All right, let's listen, guys. <laughs> no, there's a better one. Hang on, it might be mature. Pure agony. Okay, what about this one? <laughs> Guys, we're going to go for that. <laughs> You're going to be hearing that noise many times throughout this game because I'm out of practice. I don't remember. I vaguely remember things, um, but the combat, the parry system, 
Well, wish me luck. That's all I'm going to say to you. But we're going to have some fun. And this is also to celebrate spooky season, which is October. So I'm, I'm really excited, man. Uh, very nervous, but very excited too. Now, what else do I want to do here? I think we're good. All right, guys, let's get straight into it. And finalize contracts. And let's do it. Good. All signed and sealed. Now, let's begin the transfusion. Oh, don't you worry. Whatever happens, you may think it all a mere bad dream. Guys, that is horrifying. <laughs> horrifying. Right, here we go, guys. Yosefka's Clinic. <laughs> wow, all that nostalgia is just flooded back. All right, now, <laughs> guys, I cannot remember this. Okay, so, okay, that's heavy. R2's heavy. How do I transform again? Sorry, in this game, in case you're new, um, I mean, everybody's played this by now, but in case you're new, you can actually transform attacks. L1, isn't it? I think. Anyway, guys, look, wish me luck, but, um, yeah, let's just push on. What about here? Do I go here? No, we can't enter that yet. But, guys, old memories, man. This this game, I cannot tell you how many times, how many playthroughs I've, I've had with this. Anyway, let's read this. So, guys, just before I go on, I love lore. I hope you do too, right? But I love reading out, you know, bits of, um, you know, lore and information and stuff like that. I just love trying to flesh out the story. I never understood all of Bloodborne. I have watched a lot of, um, you know, lore videos. But if there's anything you guys think I should know, like in terms of story, narrative, please leave it in the comments. It'll be good for other people as well. Anyway, we'll read this. A mysterious letter, um, and it says... Seek pale blood to transcend the hunt. Wonder what that could mean. And guys, just one more thing. You know the guy who we signed the contract with? Do you reckon he was that werewolf? Because remember, he's got bandaged eyes, which means he's going to turn into a beast eventually. I'm just wondering. It's just... um. I don't think anyone's really talked about that. Okay, guys, I'm probably going to end up dying <laughs> here, but we're supposed to die so we can get our weapon. All right, I need to read these as well. So there's going to be bits of information to help me with the game. Okay, R1 attack. Okay, light attack will be R1. Okay. Oh, nothing there. Give me a sec. Okay, lock on is R3. Fantastic. I needed to know that. Right, what else? Is that it? Okay, guys. <laughs> right. Check it out. A freaking werewolf. Oh my god. I'm so frightened, guys. This has been a while. I've just not played this in such a long time. There is a way to kill him, but I don't know if I can remember how to do it. I'll try. Sorry to interrupt your dinner, sir. Okay. 
Okay. No way! Did I get him? <laughs> Guys, we got him. <laughs> Oh my god, we actually got him. Okay, listen, that was pure luck. <laughs> I did actually plan that. I just went quiet there because I thought, no, we're dead. <laughs> but but we didn't die. That's awesome. Okay, you saw that. So if you want to, that's called a visceral attack, I think. Um, it would do immense amount of damage to um, whoever you're fighting. You need to go behind enemies. Heavy attack. No, don't jump. Oh, is that how you do it? Because I didn't even know how to do jumping attacks. One sec. No, 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 no. Oh, guys, I did a back. Okay, okay. It's push forward on the stick and R2. All right, good, good. All right, anyway, <laughs> as I was saying, um, if you can manage to pull that off, you can actually, um, you know, kill an enemy in one go or just do at least immense amount of damage. I need to heal, guys. Jeez. <laughs> All right, there we go. Let's grab that. Okay. All right, what's this? Okay, restore HP, oh, obviously, right. Guys, also, if you don't mind, I'm gonna read the item thing. What about blood vials? Oh, actually, wait, wait, check this out. There's bits of lore in what we're wearing, items we find, weapons, so I'm gonna do that. Okay, Keanu, <laughs> Black Hood. Hood worn upon awakening to the nightmare of blood and beasts. Perhaps its wearer had to stay out of sight and travel by cover of darkness. Without memory, who will ever know? And how do I move on to the next one? No, don't take it off. Oh, crap. <laughs> Sorry, one sec. Press square. Okay, foreign garb. Uh, clothing worn upon awakening, blah, blah, blah. Not typical clothing for Yarnum. Perhaps it is of foreign origin. It is said, after all, the traveller came to Yarnum from afar. Without memory, who will ever know? No, don't, I keep press, pressing square, I'm so sorry. Okay. Right, bandage, a sully bandage. Bandage worn upon awakening to the nightmare of blood and beasts. Terribly worn and unsanitary. A faint memory recalls blood ministration involving the transfusion of unknown blood. Not long after, the nightmare began. And this one... Okay, trousers worn upon awakening to the nightmare of blood and beasts. Not typical clothing for Yarnum, perhaps. It is of foreign origin. It is said, after all, the traveller came to Yarnum from afar. Okay, it more or less said the same thing as before. Alright, cool. So let's move on. Okay. Guys, I'm so excited to play this again. <laughs> I better heal again. Okay. Oh my god, right. Okay, can you hear that in the background? Right, there's a big chunky dude. He's not a boss, but he's super hard. I will try to fight him, but we'll see. Anyway. I need a weapon. Oh crap, I need to actually go. Oh, uh, by the way, guys. Welcome to London. <laughs> Check it out. Amazing. <laughs> oh my god. I always miss this game when I haven't played it for a long time. Okay, this should be, yeah, Blood Vials. Fantastic. As I play the game, um, I'll get more re-familiarized with everything. So, it's been a while, guys. My goodness. Over, yeah, there's a dude here, I think. Oh, shit. I haven't got a weapon, guys. Oh, crap. How do I do this? Oh no, what do I do? What do I do? Okay, right. No, no, I'm hitting X. Okay, let's do that. Okay, that's fine. Uh, okay, guys, I'm gonna <laughs> lead him around here. We'll try and get around him. Haha, <laughs> see a <you>, sucker. <laughs> okay, listen to this, by the way. Now that is horrifying, guys. <laughs> anyway, what we're gonna do real quick. Okay, come on, dude, do you wanna kinda hurry up? Okay. No, don't do that, what are you doing? Dude! Oh my God, guys. Okay. <laughs> that was so close. Guys, that was so close.
<laughs> also. Anyway. Right, the reason I've come back here is so that we can enter the Hunter's Dream and we can get a weapon. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Hunter's Dream. We're going to be here quite a lot because I will die quite a lot, I'm suspecting. Right, now, there should be some notes here. I just need to read these just to re-familiarize myself. Uh, guys, by the way, in all my videos, I do leave uh, timestamps. If you want to skip ahead to certain sections, you can do. Uh, but if you want a thorough full experience, you know, stay with me, man. <laughs> we'll get through this together. After taking damage from an enemy, there is a period of time in which attacking the enemy in return will restore a certain amount of your HP. This is the rally system. If I've taken damage, I think it's 10 seconds or it could be less than that. But anyway, you need to get some more, try and be as aggressive as you can. You can actually gain your health back or some of it, you know. It's actually very, very useful. Okay, R1, when next to a staggered enemy, visceral attack. Okay, that's what I did to the werewolf. I can't believe I actually got away with that, guys. <laughs> Shooting your firearm will interrupt and stagger an enemy. So this is the game's uh, parry system. An enemy went properly time to their attack. Okay, uh, guys, this I'll need a shit ton of practice because I can't remember... Right, hitting an enemy from behind with a charged attack causes them to stagger. That's the um, way we kill the werewolf. Right, R2, strong attack. Hold R2, charge attack. Transform weapon. Right, this I need practice with. Anyway, guys, um, I think that's it. What's this again? All right, we can't enter that. Non oh, wait, there's more stuff here. Oh, I remember this. Right. Re emergency Quicksilver Bullet Replenishment. Uh, you don't need to worry about this. I'm only talking to beginners if you've never played this before. You'll lose a bit of HP, but you can get... If you run out of bullets, you see top left-hand corner there. It says 10 silver bullets or whatever. If I run out of them, I can get emergency bullets using my own blood. So you lose a bit of health, but you'll get five bullets back. But don't worry about that for now. It's not, not really a big deal. Switching weapons, okay, cool. So that's left and right. What about this? Oh, thank you. Okay, I needed to see this. I couldn't remember how to do this. To use items, it'll be down on directional pad and square to actually use it. Excellent, thank you. Um, I think that's it. L and circle to run. Yes, okay. Right, this is a doll, and um, she's going to be our best friend, wifey, <laughs> throughout this entire game. But she's not activated now. We've got to get something called Insight, I think. Right, the scary little dudes are actually our best friends as well. <laughs> so let's talk to them. Accept gift from messengers. The messengers offer you a trick weapon. Choose one. Trick weapons are wielded with the right hand and employed in beast hunting. Okay. I was considering the threaded cane, guys. I love threaded cane. It is pretty sick. Hunter Axe is amazing as well. But I'm going to go for something that's kind of in between, and that'll be the saw cleaver. The only reason I'm hesitating about threaded cane, it kind of, you know, when you're under whip animation, because it turns into a whip, um, it's awesome, really stylish, it's super cool. But sometimes when you, it, it does like a wide sweep of an attack. It gets caught against the walls and it bounces off. So, yeah, sometimes I've had very bad experiences with it, but it is an amazing weapon. But we're going to use a saw cleaver, and I need to install it. How do I do that again? Is it here? No, that's normal items. Okay, so we want to go here. What the? What? Did I not get... Yeah, I want to take it. Oh, I... Guys, I selected no. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh, right. Okay, here we go. I think we can read up on it as well. Right, Saw Cleaver. One of the trick weapons of the workshop commonly used in the hunting business. 
This saw, effective at drawing the blood of beasts, transforms into a long cleaver that makes use of centrifugal force. The saw, with its set of bloodletting teeth, has become a symbol of the hunt, and only grows in effectiveness uh, the more grotesquely transformed the monster. So this will be very, very good against um, beasts. Anything with fur, basically. But it's just a great all-round weapon. It probably is the best all-round weapon, I mean, best weapon, or one of the best weapons in the game. The messages offer you a firearm. Choose one. Firearms are wielded with the left hand and employed in beast hunting. All right, I actually love Blunderbuss, guys. I've done a whole playthrough of that, I remember. I did enjoy it. It was really cool. But it has to be said the Hunter Pistol might be better. Okay, so let's select that. And where does this go? No, it's not there. That's, all right, these two are for weapons. I can have a secondary weapon as well. But we're going to put this here. And let's read that, if possible. Pistol made at the workshop for hunters stalking beasts. Hunter firearms are specially crafted to employ quicksilver bullets fused with the wielder's own blood, boosting damage against beasts. The pistol is a quicker draw than the blunderbuss, allowing for speedier responses to attacks. So that's why I want to get this, for that very reason. Right, we're going to meet a dude called German <laughs> in just a second. Right, no book received from the messengers, leaves messages. I don't need this because I'm not playing online. So it doesn't really apply to me. Thanks, but no thanks. Hello, mate. Aha. You must be the new hunter. Maybe. Welcome to the hunter's dream. This will be your home for now. I am German, friend to you hunters. You're sure to be in a fine haze about now, but don't think too hard about all of this. Just go out and kill a few beasts. It's for your own good. You know, it's just what hunters do. You'll get used to it. <laughs> awesome. This was once a safe haven for hunters. A workshop where hunters used blood to enhance their weapons and flesh. We don't have as many tools as we once did, but you're welcome to use whatever you find. Even the dog, should it please you. You dirty old man. <laughs> <laughs> this was once all right he just says the same thing okay that's fine all right now i don't remember all this guys okay wait there's some something to read here right to escape this dreadful hunter's dream halt the skirt the sorcery of the spreading scourge of beasts lest the knights carry on forever um this is what i think has happened to german oh well, i can't remember guys i'm sorry if i'm not making sense i'm just trying to remember everything and i really can't i can't do anything here though can i okay this is where you would upgrade weapons repair your weapons i don't have any i don't have anything <laughs> basically so all right we leave that alone for now there's something here as well but i don't remember guys all right look i tell you what let's just get back into it remember this is all in timestamps. So if you want to skip this entire section you can this dude will sell us stuff doesn't he i i can't remember again guys but anyway let's get back into it so i've got a weapon we've got a gun let's go let's boogie all right i'll see you in your arm guys Hey guys, we're back. Okay, I kind of messed up actually. I should have went to the first... Uh, okay, let me show you, let me show you. Right, we're going to go and kill that arsehole that was down below. <laughs> that's so cool. Okay, let's kick the shit out of him. Okay. Listen, he's from London. Well, we are in London. London is not very friendly, so... <laughs> okay, so he's down... 
Uh, what else was there? Okay, good. We need more blood vials anyway. Okay, we'll grab that. Oh, yeah, I remember. There's two dudes here. So, Lee, let me practice this. It works. Excellent. Okay, guys, I'm going to do a parry. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, guys, I suck. As you can clearly see, this will take some practice, the parry system. I just don't remember the timings. It's literally before they attack you. They're about to hit you. That's when you would um, do it. Now, what's this? What is this? Oh, Molotovs. Yes. Okay. Okay. Right. We want to put this here. And can we read anything about it? We can. A Molotov cocktail explodes in raging flames when thrown against an object. One of the oldest hunter tools available in the workshop. Right. Since the tragedy that struck old Yarnum, fire has become a staple in beast hunts and is thought to cleanse impurity. Certain types of beasts have an abnormal fear of flame. Okay, this is actually quite awesome. And old Yarnum, very sad. Yeah, there is a very sad, um, tragic backstory to that. Uh, what is this again, guys? Sacrifice all blood echoes and awaken anew. I don't remember, guys. Dangling upside down rune etched in one's mind. Symbol of a hunter. By focusing one's thoughts on this rune, a hunter loses all blood echoes, but awakens afresh as if we're all just a bad dream. I don't rem Guys, I don't remember this at all. <laughs> Sorry, someone in the comments. I'll probably look it up anyway in between this and the next episode. Right, the reason I came back down here is actually to speak to Yosefka. And the werewolf is dead, right? <laughs> I hope. Oh, gosh. No, he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Yeah, and guys, I'm sort of not 100%. I'm kind of convinced our wealth was actually the guy we signed a contract with. Okay, we've read this already. All right, give me a moment. All right, check it out. Are you out on the hunt? Then I'm very sorry, but I cannot open this door. I am Yosefka. The patients here in my clinic must not be exposed to infection. I know that you hunt for us, for our town, but I'm sorry. Please. This is all that I can do. Okay, yes, Yosefka's blood vial. Now, go. And good hunting. All right, guys, if I'll try and let me just try and zo not zoom in, but can you see through that gap in the door? You can kind of see her. <laughs> anyway, let's talk to her again. Are you still in need of something? Yes. But I have nothing more to offer. Yes. Please try to understand my position. I can only pray for a fruitful hunt. All right, guys. Okay, we can't actually enter this place we are gonna meet her again later in the game sort of <laughs> all right there's more of these here give me a sec all right shoot okay fine l2 options menu okay fine okay back step is just circle roll quick step is direction and then circle oh okay cool okay so i'm on a locked on enemy so if they're striking me... Sorry, guys, I'm just thinking out loud. I'm, well, talking out loud. Okay, we've done that already. All right, let's get back out there. And, by the way, we need to put that there. And let's read it real quick. Blood vial acquired from the lady doctor at Yosefka's clinic. This refined blood, highly invigorating, restores a larger amount of HP. This rare blood vial is a product of a slow and careful refinement process likely devised by the doctor herself okay excellent so if i need a quick heal um it will boost i think half of your health i think i could be misremembering guys if um if i said anything incorrect please leave in the comments so i know for next time 
All right, back in London. <laughs> All right, let's move on. We're going to talk to an NPC up there. I can't remember his name. Is it Graham? No, it's Gilbert. <laughs> Not Graham. Jesus. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Oh, you must be a hunter. And not one from around here either. I'm Gilbert, a fellow outsider. You must have had a fine time of it. Yarnum has a special way of treating guests. Well, I don't think I could stand if I wanted to, but I'm willing to help if there's anything that can be done. This town is cursed. Whatever your reasons might be, you should plan a swift exit. Whatever can be gained from this place, it will do more harm than good. Pale blood, you say? Hmm. Never heard of it. But if it's blood you're interested in, you should try the healing church. The church controls all knowledge on blood ministration and all varieties of blood. Across the valley to the east of Yarnum lies the town of the Healing Church, known as the Cathedral Ward. And deep within Cathedral Ward is the old Grand Cathedral, the birthplace of the Healing Church's special blood, or so they say. <laughs> Yarnumites don't share much with outsiders, Normally, they wouldn't let you near the place, but the hunt is on tonight. This might be your chance. All right, guys, so you heard the man. <laughs> you need to, um, uh, basically, we just need to go out there and explore and stuff like that. There is a shortcut there. We're going to open that later on. All right, let's grab this. What is that again? Pebbles. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sorry, guys. The nostalgia is really hitting me okay small pebbles found throughout yarnum can be thrown at foes quite thrilling <laughs> now it looks like an eyeball i don't know the law behind that if anyone can explain that to me that'll be quite awesome all right i need to practice guys so let me try a parry okay good that kind of worked i'm not gonna lie guys that was actually lucky <laughs> i panicked in this shot but um that worked but i wasn't thinking about it if that makes sense that wasn't planned basically i just hit r2 <laughs> right transform and transform back you die bitch <laughs> okay right he should have a whole bunch of buddies down here and he does hello bitches hello all right let's go up here <laughs> all right okay and you oh my how dare you okay okay cool right let me heal oh shit okay guys there's gonna be a dude Wait, hold on. Well, there's plenty of dudes. <laughs> More specifically, there's going to be a chunky guy. Oh, do I want to fight him now? What the hell? <laughs> I was sliding down the stairs. <laughs> All right. Anyway, let's open this up. This is a shortcut. Right, I'm trying to think of an exit because if this guy kicked kicks the shit out of me anyway this is our shortcut and take the stairs back up to the save point all right i'm just thinking how do i fight this dude we gotta parry him because i'm so scared i'm so scared oh i pressed the wrong button guys i pressed the wrong button oh my god i can't believe this shit Oh my god. Okay, get up, get up. Okay. Okay, guys. <laughs> guys, guys, let me heal. Does he follow me out here, though? No, no. Lock on. Oh, you freaking arsehole. Oh, I can't believe this, guys. He takes an hour to... Right. Oh, 
Okay, guys, I can't attack him now. We have to power him again. <laughs> guys, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Oh, my God. Oh, we did it. Okay, I'm so sorry. That was super sloppy. In fact, that was outright terrible. But what happened was, you know, when I first got that uh, parry, I was like really excited and happy. I hit R2 by accident. You're supposed to hit R1. <laughs> so that was... Oh! Tempering Blood Gemstone. This is our first... Um, uh, okay, these are like um, uh, gemstones you can put into your weapon to make it a bit stronger. You can put some, I think, elements in there like fire and stuff like that. I mean, we don't have to worry about that now because we can't do it yet i think we got to get a special tool but i don't remember from where and when oh my god guys that was <laughs> bloody, bloody terrible but hey we got through it in the end but um very sloppy why did i hit r2 god damn it rune bay idiot <laughs> anyway so there should be some npcs we can talk to i think right i think there shouldn't be any enemies here so we should be all right. Anyway, let's speak to some of um, these people here. Lads, you have come up. He's opened their door on a night of the hunt. Away with you. Now. Away with you. Now. Nah. All right, there's a dude here. Right, check this out. Okay. All right, there's a pitchfork guy here. Okay. Okay, I had to... Oh, shit, I'm running out of uh, Quicksilver. Shit. Okay, I don't want to be too spammy with the uh, bullets. <laughs> okay, this guy is a bitch, so we can kill him quite easily. Oh crap! All right. Okay, I'm not saying that I'm a hundred percent getting there but things are starting to click again guys it's literally shit there's a crap ton of dudes here i can't remember the strat i don't remember but um but anyway things are slowly coming back to me there's a yeah i knew it there's a guy here piece of shit this turn's finished well it is with our current government <laughs> and those you know know is there like a secret entrance here? No, I'm getting this mixed up with something else. There's another place. If you knock over the barrels, it'll reveal another pathway. That's much later. Oh, crap! Oh, shit, shit, shit. I forgot about this bastard. <laughs> oh, my God. Guys, that was a blatant jump scare. My goodness. Totally forgot about him. Arsehole. Right, there's a whole shit ton of them here. How do I do this? What did I used to do here? Oh crap, he's uh, it's too late. There's nothing I can do. He's seen me already. Oh no, what are you doing, you idiot? Okay, good, 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 good. <laughs> right, that dude that walked away towards that gate, he's a gunner. So I want to be kind of careful. Right, I want to kill and slaughter all these Londoners because they're not very friendly. <laughs> all right. Hello, bitches. Oh, crap. Run, 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 run. Come on, hurry up. I need to practice the back step as well. Just simply doing that. Because that's quite an important um, defensive move. Now, who else was here? Hello, mate. All right. Oh, he's turning into a beast already. My goodness. All right. Okay. Um, why am I here? Is there something here? I think. Oh, there's an NPC we can speak to. Are you that outsider? Well, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Trot along, will ya? <laughs> All right, so we got more Molotovs. I don't think we need that right now. 
Guys, if I'm not mistaken, I used to use a Molotovs against, um, I think Cleric Beast and Father Gascoigne. I can't remember though, exactly. No, there's a shooter guy. I know what to do, guys. Wait, just give me a moment. My memory's coming back to me. I'm having total recall <laughs> at the moment. But give me a sec. I, I do remember something. I want to go around because... Wait, what's this? Okay, more bullets. Good. Okay, let's uh, visceral this bastard here. R1. Good. All right, good. He's out of the picture. Now, there's a shooter guy up there. Or a rifle dude. There's a dog behind that carriage, I believe. You know what, guys? Screw it. Let's just YOLO. <laughs> YOLO. Oh, okay, guys. Let's go for the dog quickly. Oh, no. Oh, this is a bad idea. Bad idea, guys. Okay, good. Wait, there's someone behind me. There's someone behind me. What's my fault? What have I done? <laughs> Alright, grab that. Oh boy, I'm so nervous, guys. I'm so nervous. We'll make it through. Somehow we'll make it through. But let's kill this bitch. No, no, jump. Oh, I didn't want to jump, guys. That was meant to be the visceral. Come on. He's still alive? You tough bastard. Oh, mash up your brain. Guys, I've not heard them say, away, away. <laughs> That's my favorite line out of all of uh, Bloodborne. Oh, guys. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I know what to do. I was, I was going to say pebbles, right? This is how we use the pebble, I think. You piece of shit. All right, here we go. Right, anyone else? Okay, let's try him. No, he's going to take forever, guys. Um... One second, let me plan this. Wait, check this out. Is he going to come down the stairs? Can you see him? There's a dude there. All right, watch this. YOLO. Oh, crap, the machine gun. Not machine gun, but the gun dude see me. But that's okay. We're okay. Hello, buddy. All right, as you can see, there's a ton of skeletons there. But look at this. It's a werewolf. Wait. I'm trying to get a good angle. That's so frightening, guys. My goodness. Imagine seeing this in your on your street. <laughs> Horrifying. But it's awesome. Okay, are there any dudes left down here? Alright, there might be, but it doesn't matter. Who cares? Alright, let's grab that. Blood file. Fantastic. What about this? Bullets. And uh, there's a big chunky boy behind this gate. Uh, good practice for parries as well. So I need to um, I need to fight him. Right, there's some bullets there. Let me grab that. Wait, where's this? oh? It's here. Oh man, do I have to go? Really? Oh, run up the stairs again. Oh, no, no. Actually, I do need to go up here. Because there is an item here, and I don't remember what it is. This one. Okay, cold blood dew. Am I right in saying that gives you echoes if you consume it? I'm pretty certain it is that. Okay, let's grab this. Guys, the atmosphere is insane. Okay, we're going to check out those uh, people laughing. But there's some birds here, and I hate these things. I hate them, guys. Oh, you bastard! <laughs> you arsehole! You see why I hate them, guys? Okay, what is this? Oil urn. How? 
how would I use that? Oh, yeah, you would use that first and basically throw it at an enemy. Then you throw a Molotov and it will make it do double damage, I think. Right, we can't visceral him, so we just... All right, anyway, I'm going to shut up. Let me concentrate. All right, okay, good. All right, he's not fully dead yet, so... Oh, God. <laughs> terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Anyway, grab all of that. No, don't do that, dude. Stop it. <laughs> oh, excellent. We got a torch. Okay. Oh, no, it's not in here. Sorry, put it here. Okay, see so if there's anything we we'll read, and that'll be torch. A common torch formed by wrapping a pine resin drenched cloth around the end of a long stick. Hunters choose torches not only because the hunt leads them to the darkest nooks, but also because certain creatures they encounter are possessed of a deathly fear of flame. All right, awesome. And obviously, it will, you know, lighten <laughs> dark areas. Okay, guys, there was a method to this um, route. I don't think I go up here now. I think I go here later, I think. Right, we're going to see what's so funny. <laughs> Why these ladies are laughing. Actually, we'll never know, but whatever. I don't reckon you're from round here. Well, stuck outside on a night of the hunt. Oh, you poor, poor thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, do we get any more dialogue? I don't reckon you're from round here. No, nothing. All right. All right. Let's move on. Now, there should be some dogs here, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, shit. Is he outside? Uh, guys? What the hell is... Whoa. Okay. Okay, that's weird. No, there's one behind me. There's one behind me. Shit. Oh, my God. What the hell? <laughs> Sorry, guys. That really made me panic. Anyway, some more dogs here. Uh, Keanu, can you kill the dogs, please? All right, someone here. Um, is there any more? Okay, there's one up there, but we're not going to worry about him just yet. I think we go up here for a shortcut, I think. <laughs> I don't remember, guys. I can't remember. Okay, give me a sec. Oh, no, this is a dead end, but we do get an item. Okay, more of that cold blood. Dude, I'm very convinced that will give us echoes if I need it. Okay, now remember, there's two chunky boys down here, but we're not going to fight them, not just yet. Right, here we go. Check it out. Right, need to open this. There's a dude here. Okay. There's two guys upstairs, if I'm not mistaken, and in fact, let me do that. All right, don't feel bad about killing this guy in a wheelchair. He will show you no mercy. <laughs> All right, let's check this out. What is that? Right, pungent blood cocktail. Mature blood cocktail that releases a pungent odor when thrown that attracts bloodthirsty beasts. A precious tool in sadly short supply. In Yarnum, they produce more blood than alcohol, as the former is the more intoxicating. All right, guys, um, if memory serves, we can throw pungent blood at a wall, and that will make werewolves and um, other beasts run over to it, and you can attack the beast and get free hits. Am I right in saying that? But anyway, when the hunt began, the healing church abandoned us, blocking the great bridge to the cathedral ward as they burned old Yarnum to the ground on that moonlit night. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty tragic. But, hey, get up, dude. Oh, my God. Dude, get up, you freaking ass. Get up. Right, there's a dude upstairs, but let's open this door first. And what do I do again? All right, give me a moment, guys. Give me a moment. Okay, let's kill this dude. And there's one other guy here. If I 
remember. Yep, here we go. Okay, good. Okay, and what now? What now? I th okay, guys, give me a sec. I'll kill him, but we need to run back down and then we're going to come back here. I think that's how this goes. I used to have a very specific route um, when I used to play this, but I don't know if this is correct. But I'll anyway, we'll see. We'll see. Um, we'll see, guys. That bell is so spooky. It's awesome, guys. I love it. All right, so we got to kill this dude, and there should be a shortcut. Okay. All right, check it out. So grab that. And here we go. There's a shortcut. And that's where Gilbert is, and that's where the save point is. All right. Anyway. Now, there's two chunk boys downstairs. Um, do I want to fight them now, though? Ah, crap. Shit. Okay, let me lead him. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm trying to get them separated as much as possible. Come on, you piece of shit. Okay, still alive. Oh! But he missed! He missed! Guys, I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Here we go. Okay, good. Oh, my God. Okay. Alright. Good. Right, so they're good for farming blood files. Early game. Um, can I go here now? There should be a lift here, guys. I'm just wondering, can I... No, no, we can't. Wait, hold on. Just give me a sec, guys. Let me think. I think I know where to go. Uh, basically, we need to go around so we end up upstairs so that I can activate the lift. And if I'm not mistaken... Hold up, hold up. Give me a sec. Give me a second. Okay, this is where the dogs were. There's a lady NPC we can meet. Um, she's a legend. <laughs> Um, but we're not going to meet her yet, I don't think. I think it's up here, right? No, 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 no. Sorry, guys. Give me a second. I'm very confused right now. No, I know where to go. Okay, check this out. There is something I need. Okay, we need to go upstairs. Right, there's going to be two werewolves. And, guys, I don't want to mess with them. There is a way to cheese them. Okay, all right. Unlock. Run. <laughs> run. They're so frightening. Okay. Oh my god. Guys, I hate when they do a sudden attack. Let me see if this helps. Yeah, well, it does a bit of damage, but I'll lose a lot of stamina. Okay, his brother has joined the fight. They can still kill you through here, guys. It's happened to me before. All right. All right. Good, good, good. <laughs> this is so frightening, man. Okay. No, 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 no. Um, Guys, can I shoot him? Wait, let me try. Let me try. No. Damn it. Come on, attack me, bitch. Oh, wait. I tried to visceral. Oh, God! Oh, gosh, it was trying to pull me outside. All right. All right, here we go. Guys, that's so scary, man. Oh, thank God. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. All right, nice. We've got some blood vials. Dude, can you stop celebrating? It's too early. <laughs> okay. Right, Keanu is very... 
enthusiastic. Now, why am I here again? Wait, hold up a minute. Hold up, hold up. Uh, no, no, that's not what I wanted. Goodness gracious, I'm pressing the wrong buttons. I need Molotovs. I'll show you why in a second. In fact, we'll do it now. <laughs> okay, nice. <laughs> Can you pick that up, please? Okay. All right, guys. There should be a couple more enemies, two dogs, and I think there's a another shooter. Oh, crap. Here we go. Guys, I hate dogs. I hate them so much. Uh, I mean, in in from soft games. Okay, is he dead? He is. He is. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm getting used to kind of dodging and because we're gonna have to fight a boss a bit later, you know. So trying to get good. <laughs> trying to okay so grab all of that um i don't think there's anything else here wait hold up guys give me a second can you hear this there's like a music box song thing okay if you can hear that that's going to be uh important a bit later but don't have to worry about it right now now this should be an item here to collect what is this? All right, good. All right, so what I'd like to do is go up here. Um, show you why in a second. And if I'm remembering cor uh, correctly, guys, there's going to be some horrifically difficult enemies. Okay, there's an item here. Let's grab this real quick. Okay. Right, Bloodstone Shards is what will allow you to upgrade your weapons, I think. Alright, please, I hope I'm right about this. Okay, here we go. Right, 10 pebbles. Yeah, we don't need to worry about that really, but anyway. Check it out, so there's a hidden entrance here. Or a pathway, rather. And I don't remember this. But I do remember it was tough. Should I take the ladder? Yeah, let's take the ladder. Okay, screw it. Oh, I can see some rats. <laughs> All right, how do I do this again? Um, okay, let's go here. There should be a couple of enemies here. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Sorry, I'm, I'm just... Um, I'm just trying to piece everything together because I'm doing this all from memory. Right, check it out. There's a dude up there. Any items before I go? No. Right, we're going to fight him. Now, I don't like these guys, but the one I'm really scared of... ...is not him. He's got a buddy that has a pole. A big metal pole. <laughs> it's He's so deadly. So he's one I'm more scared of. Anyway... Let's go down here. Oh, he still got me, man. Well, I tried to rally as much as I could back, but, um, guys, we need to heal. Because this dude, I hate him. Especially early game. He's got ridiculously, very deceptively uh, long reach. And he hits so hard, and he can just stun lock you as well. Oh crap, here we go guys, here we go. Oh crap. Really? Okay, 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 that's fine. Alright, stay calm. Okay, he's still alive, bastard. <laughs> Alright. Now you can see why I'm shit scared of these dudes. I, I hate them so much. I really do. Okay, now, again, I'm trying to plan out to do this. There's going to be some rats down here. Oh, shit, there's another pole guy down there as well. Okay, okay, we'll, we'll sort him out. Give me a sec. Let me heal. Right, excellent. Okay, now, do I want to take the ladder or do I... No, no, here's what we do. Here's what we do. Check it out. 
There's a rat down there if you can see him. Okay. How do I do this? Okay, good, 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 good. Right, he's out of the way. We gotta be very careful here, guys. Right, this dude is a pole guy, but he's got a bit more health than the other one. Oh my god, really, dude? Oh, I got him! <laughs> I got him, guys. Okay, one sec. Oh, we did it. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, we got him, guys. We got him. Now, this is why I came down. It's for this. Check it out. So this is the trademark Bloodborne look. And it is much uh, better than what we're wearing. So check it out. So all our stats go up, which is awesome. Right, let's see if we can read any lore. Hunter hats. One of the standard articles of hunter attire fashioned at the workshop. A fine piece of hunter attire that provides stable defense to anyone facing Yarnum's beastly threat. Recognizable by its withered feathers, this cap is fashioned after one of the old hunters. All right, what about the garb? Oh, sorry. Okay, one of the standard articles, blah, 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 uh, at the workshop, accompanied with a short cape to wipe away blood. A fine piece of hunter tider provides stable defense. He's, he's already said that. Okay, allows one to stalk beasts unannounced by cover of night. Okay. And this one. Okay, one of the standard blah, blah, blah. A fine piece of blah, blah, blah again. <laughs> it's more or less saying the same thing. Allow yeah, it's the same thing, guys. What about this? No, that's the same. I've just read that to myself. Okay, it's fine. But anyway, you get the gist. It's awesome. And look at it. With the sunglasses as well, guys. <laughs> that is amazing. Oh, I love this game. It's so good. But I'm not going to lie, guys. I'm so frightened. It's It just... Like, every moment that passes, I'm just so frightened. Oh, damn it. I should have come down here yet. Not this way, anyway. Um... Guys, again, give me a moment. I'm trying to remember stuff. Do I want to go here now? <sighs> you know what? Let's go down here. Okay, check it out. Okay. Oh, damn it. Right, check it out. There's going to be some um, <laughs> horrifying enemies here that don't have any legs. Okay, right, check it out. Now, do I want a Molotov him? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Let's throw this. Okay, our arcane is quite low. And what that means is any elemental attacks we do will be uh, um, weaker. So, guys, they are horrifying. They kind of look like Chewy. <laughs> Chewbacca a little bit. Skinny versions. Okay. Anyway. All right. Here we go. There should be another one here as well. Not, not with this group. Wait. Are you one? Yep. You are one. Dude. <laughs> okay. Here we go. All right, here we go. More bullets. Um, now what? Okay, I think we did it. So that's all of them dead. Oh, search corpse. Okay. Yes, gimme, gimme. Okay, I thought this led somewhere. It doesn't. Oh my God, guys, my memory is so crap. What is up here again? And why would I come here? Right, there's birds. There's going to be a pig. Sorry, guys. Give me a moment. I need to think. There's going to be a pig up there. And, and I think we can access the lift. I just want to try and... Okay, okay. Leave it to me. Right, what we're going to do... Let's keep pushing forwards. Right, there's... <laughs> right, there's another Wookiee. Oh, there's two of them. Guys, they're so scary, man. God damn it. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, you bastard. Oh, crap. Okay, he did a launching attack. Can I rally any health? Ah, not, not really. You bitch. All right, good. Now, birds. How do I deal with you? I think I just shoot them. Oh, crap. <laughs> Guys, I hate these things so much. Okay, good. Now, is there a reason to come down here? Hmm. Anyway. Anyway. All right. Oh shit, there's three of them, guys. I don't want to use up my Molotovs. Let's save them. Okay, let's go back, get stamina. And there we go. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Yeah, you'll typically find these guys in London as well, so <laughs> if you want to visit. Oh crap. Oh shit, I forgot about that. They poison as well. I totally forgot about this. No, don't, please. Guys, I need to heal. My goodness. I'm doing really shit. Wow, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Wow. <laughs> okay. All right. They do a few surprise attacks. So I need to be kind of careful. Right. Okay, new there's going to be a dude here having a lovely nap. <laughs> and I've just interrupted it. Okay, blood vial and what's this? Okay, another bloodstone shard. Now, do I want to fight the pig now? Wait, there's birds as well. God damn it. Right. Okay, my fault. I didn't lock on. Okay, good, 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 good. Right, directly in there, inside that tunnel, is a ginormous pig. <laughs> and he's really tough. I don't know what to do, though. I can't remember what, what it was I had to do here. Oh, my God. Do I run in? Is the lift up here, or do I have to go to where the pig is? All right, just give me a moment, guys. Let's go up here first. I'm going to go back down. Don't worry, but I just want to see... If, okay, if I'm correct about this, the girl should be up here. Oh, no, it's, it's okay, the lift's here, yes! Guys, this is why I came here. It's for this. Right, check it out. Wow, Keanu looks awesome, guys. Look at that. <laughs> that is so sick. All right, so that's now activated the lift. We can use that at our leisure. So, yeah, I want to go back. There's still more to do. Um, you know where the dogs were? But I'll do all that in a second. I'm trying to remember how to do this. If I kill the pig, I'll end up across there. Okay, guys, I'm so sorry I'm mumbling, man. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to remember everything here. But then again, we can go this way. You know what? Screw it. Let's go this way. I'm gonna heal first. Okay, run in a zigzag. You'll see in a minute why. Okay, there's a lo load of Londoners here, but there's a boulder up there and it's a bit late. Hey, hey, stop that. Oh, you... Oh! Okay. Away! Away! Oh, crap! <laughs> oh, that's so funny, guys. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. Right, so... Okay, grab that. Did I do drop anything? Anyway, let's go up here. Okay, we've got Chunk Boy here. If I kill the pig and then seen these two guys, I think we'll be able to kill Big Boy here, but... Uh, why? Uh, guys, I should have... Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, 
Okay, good, 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 good. All right, Father Gascoigne is up there. And I don't know if I want to fight Father Gascoigne now or do that in the next episode. Or we could fight the Cleric Beast. I'm not sure, guys. I haven't thought about it yet. I mean, I've opened the lift, so that is ready. I need to meet an NPC as well. Let's kill this pig first. I'll, I'm still deciding what to do, guys. Okay, can you hear that? <laughs> Alright, there's a, a very large pig here. Give me a second. Oh, no, it's this way. My goodness. Okay, just be very careful. Alright, so we can visceral attack him. Basically, we're going to shove our arm right up his ass. <laughs> Okay, and we'll do a leaping attack. And there we go, done. He gives a shit ton of echoes and files as well. Okay, what's this again? What is that? Saw Hunter badge. Oh, if you want to buy the... Hey, dude, can you get up, please? <laughs> Stop resting. We're not, we're not ready to rest. Stop it. Okay, that's if I didn't collect the saw... Hunter. It's more or less a saw cleaver, but I think it's all serrated. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, guys. I don't remember. And I'm trying to remember what to do now. Because <laughs> I can't remember, guys. Okay, let's go back up here. Right. We need to get back to where the dogs are. Oh, I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? No, I haven't. No, no, no. I haven't. I haven't. All right, check it out. Let's go back up here. Okay, check it out. Right, let's go up this way. All right, the werewolves are dead. Um, most, mostly everyone's gone. Um... Ah, oh, shoot. Think. Come on, Rune. Think. Think. Right, dogs. This is it. Okay, we need to go this way. Right, check it out. There's a dog here barking at some... Um... Wait, no. No, there's a dog here. Wait, give me a sec, guys. There's also a dog here. Yeah, here we go. It's a good thing I remembered because <laughs> he does love to surprise you, you know? All right. Okay, let's kill this piece of shit. You're a hunter, aren't you? Then, well, do you know of any safe places? I've heard I have. Shutting up indoors isn't always enough. Well, if you want to go off your arse, you wouldn't be in this mess. You're obligated to help me, you hear? You hear? <laughs> Are you going to tell me you're not? No. <laughs> Just a blatant no. <laughs> I should have known. You stood for nothing. No respect for the elderly is what that is. That lot of good you outsiders do. Go on. Admit it. You think we're all mad, don't you? Well, go and stuff it. <laughs> your well, guys, you heard a lady. We've got to stuff it. <laughs> all right, anyway, now. I'm trying to remember this. We're going to meet a NPC. She's one of my favorite characters in the entire game. All right, not yet. Let's clear the area. Let's secure the area. <laughs> All right, give me a sec. Okay, remember, these guys are not to be underestimated, but there's one... I've already explained this. There's one that frightens the living shit out of me. It's this dude here. That's another pole guy. There should be two more po uh, pole guys, I think, in this level. I hate them, guys. I don't know about you lot, but I hate this piece of crap. All right, here we go. Right, there should be a gunner. Yep, there he is. <laughs> awesome. 
Okay, grab some of that. Let's take care of this piece of shit. Okay, good. All right, there's several rats below us. And there's going to be stuff up... Uh, anyway, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm jumping ahead. In my brain, I'm trying to... Oh, crap. All right, here we go. Here we go, guys. Okay. Right, I'm trying to think. Is there any items there I may have missed? You know what, guys? I need to get this out of the way. Hold on a second. I need to get this out of the way. We'll go and see that NPC in a minute. No, I can't. Damn it, I was going to attack. I can't yet. Just give me a sec. Give me a sec. Right, in the distance, there's a pole werewolf prick. You know, whatever. Right, oh shit. Okay, you see me. Too late. I can't do anything now. Okay, this isn't who I want. Okay, just getting my stamina back. We're going to run back in here. Okay. Okay, here we go. Wish me luck. Oh my god, okay, he's dead. Guys, honestly, I hate these pole dudes. <laughs> I hate them with a passion. They just stun lock you. They hit unbelievably hard. Um, anyway, he's taken care of. Now, we're not going to jump down. Not just yet. Uh, I'll show you what to do. <laughs> like, I know what I'm talking about, guys. I was going to do this as a walkthrough last year, but um, I think I played Ghost of Tsushima. Oh, and guys, please check out my um, uh, Sekiro uh, playthrough. I did as a blind playthrough. And guys, next to Bloodborne, next to Bloodborne, one of the greatest games of all time. And I'm addicted to the combat in that game. That's another game I miss, and I really want to do a new game plus with that as well. All right, so we're going to come back here, but not now. We need to see an NPC. So we come back here and we drop. Right, okay, I'm thinking out loud, guys. Sorry. Oh, there is an item here. I forgot. Right, it's going to be rats below us. Yeah, sorry, as I was saying, I was going to do this as a walkthrough last uh, last year, and I did remember stuff. Remembered where all the collectibles are, you know, how to beat bosses, etc. But guys, honestly, when you've not touched the game in over a year, and you play other games, you will forget. <laughs> You're going to forget stuff. I mean, I'm relearning as I play, and things are coming back to me. In fact, let me drop these things now, and I will speak to the NPC. Careful. Oh, careful. Okay. All right. Here we go. Let's grab that. Um, okay. How do I do this again? No, that's wrong. Damn it. Okay. One sec. Okay. Let's try this again. Yes. Excellent. Okay. So here R2 will do a wide sweep so you don't um, travel forwards and fall off this damn thing. <laughs> okay. So grab that as well. Is there anything behind these barrels? Sorry, guys. I'm trying to remember. I don't remember. Well, it doesn't hurt to check. Let's have a look. No, there's nothing here. Okay. But hey, at least I'll know for next time. All right. Check it out. Now, is there anything else to do here? Not really. Just this. Okay, so same principle. So let's get a wide sweep. Hit R2. Right, there we go. So we'll pick that up later. And one of my favorite NPCs. Is there any collectibles here? No. Okay, let's talk to this lovely lady. A hunter must hunt. <laughs> oh. A hunter, are you? And an outsider? What a mess you've been caught up in. And tonight of all nights. Here, to welcome the new hunter. Oh, bold hunter's mark. Again, what do I do with that? Is that to teleport me back? Prepare yourself for the worst. 
There are no humans left. They're all flesh-hungry beasts now. Basically Londoners. <laughs> Still lingering about. What's wrong? A hunter unnerved by a few beasts. <laughs> no matter. Without fear in our hearts, we're a little different from the beasts themselves. Right, that's a gesture. <laughs> now, anything else? What are you still? Doing? Oh, get up! Enough trembling in your boots. A hunter must hunt. <laughs> that's why I wanted to talk to her, guys. It was to get that line out of her. All right, I think that's it. There's no more items we can get, unless I'm forgetting. So let me know in the comments if I'm forgetting something. Um, now what? Right, we want to go down below to where the rats are. Um, let me think. Sorry, guys, give me a moment. Is it here? <laughs> Sorry, guys, give me a moment. Give me a moment. I'm trying to think about this. No, no, that's where we kill. Okay, I get it. I get it. So we, let's go this way first. Hold on. I know what to do now. It's just a safe way of doing it because I'll lose too much health. But you can roll, right? Ah, shit. Crap. <laughs> Okay, so we need to do this twice. Right, let's go here. Right, there should be some rats here. Oh, no! Oh, God, sorry, guys. <laughs> sorry about that. Okay, these things can be deadly, so just be careful. They can kill you. Oh, that's horrifying. It really is. But it's so awesome. Okay. Um. Right. Okay, I remember them. Two rats there. We'll get them in a minute. Let's grab that. Right, this is the sword spear. Now... Oh, shit, 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 shit. Guys. <laughs> sorry. I came in here to read this out to you guys, but um, there was a rat here. In fact, in fact, guys, let's just be safe. Right, let's kill this piece of shit. Right, now. Okay, Saw Spear. And what's the difference between that? I'm just looking at the stats first before I read. Physical attack 90 plus 8. I don't remember what that means. Is that quality? I don't remember, guys. I'm so sorry. Um, attributes. D and D. Strength and skill. Guys, I can't remember the difference, but if I had to guess, this will do, I think both transformations will do serrated damage, which heavily damages beasts. Uh, any, anything that's hairy, any furry creatures, basically. Sword Spear. One of the trick weapons of the workshop commonly used by those who dedicate themselves to the hunt. This saw, effective at drawing the blood of beasts transforms into a medium range spear it does a poke attack i do remember that the saw with its set of bloodletting teeth has become a symbol of the hunt and only grows in effectiveness the more grotesquely transform all right it's the same thing as a sword clear okay guys i may give this a try against cleric beast i don't know it, it more or less the mechanics are roughly the same right however the um let me transform it first Oh, it's not a po I thought it was a poke. It's not. Oh, okay. Interesting. Anyway, whatever. Let's um kill those two rats there. We got to go back up, though, <laughs> just so that we can get the item there. Oh, crap. Oh, it's the what the... Wow. No. No, please. No, please. No, you didn't lock on. Why didn't you lock on? No, no, please. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go go back to Saw Cleaver. <laughs> Sorry. Shit. Why are you so difficult? What the hell? <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I did expect it to be that hard. I mean, normally I just kill these two, but I swear. Other rats jump down. Madman's knowledge. Okay. Again, I can't remember this, man. But this is important. I just don't remember why. Anyway. 
Right, let me read this. Bolt Hunter's Mark. Dangling upside down, the image upon this parchment allows one to envision the rune with clarity. Allows the hunter to awaken again without losing blood echoes. A trick that seems nearly too good to be true. So, does it take me just to the save point or do I go back to the hunter's dream? I, I don't know. Anyway, let's keep going. What's this again? Skull of a madman touched by the wisdom of the great ones. We're going to find out more about them much, much later in the game. Used to gain insight. Making contact with eldritch wisdom is a blessing, for even if it drives one mad, it allows one to serve a grander purpose for posterity. I think we can take one of these now, right? How do I consume it? Equip, remove. How do I take it now? Oh, wait, I know what to do. Okay, let's use it. I, I don't know if I'm doing this right or wrong, guys, but... um. Ah, screw it. Let's just take it. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, this will allow us, I think, to upgrade our weapons. And the doll will be activated now? I think. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I don't know. Just doing this from memory. Right. Okay, it's now safe to go down here. There's going to be rats here as well, so we'll take care of them. But it's safe to go here because the pole dude is dead. All those um, Chewbacca enemies are dead. The shooters are dead. If I didn't kill the shooters, they would have been shooting me down here. So, obviously, you don't want that to happen. All right, I need to think. I swear there was more rats here, guys. No, there's crow. Oh, crap. I know, what, I know what to do. My bad. Ignore me. Check this out. We need to climb up here. I better take a heal. All right, so, um, hold on, guys. Sorry, my memory is just, yeah, we do go back here. Oh, I know where to go. Okay, check this out. All right, we need to drop down this way. There's still more rats. I really need to heal, my goodness. Right, you piece of shit. <laughs> okay. Right, the rats that were in here or in the second room jumped down here to gank me with his um, brothers and sisters. I didn't appreciate that. It wasn't very nice of him. So we've collected everything that needs to be collected here. So let's go this way. But ultimately, where am I going, though? All right, what's up here again? Is there a ladder here? No, the pole guy was... Okay, I, I think I know where I, where I am. So, um... Right, just give me a moment. Sorry, guys, I'm just thinking to myself. Thinking, thinking. Right, there's some birds. Oh, we need to see the little girl. My goodness. That's what I was forgetting. And I haven't decided which boss to go for. Um, and we're going to level up anyway before we face them. All right, check it out. Okay, all right, good, 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 good. Okay, good, good. But, but, guys, there is one that's hidden. You bastard. <laughs> you bastard. Right, there we go. Oh, no, he's still alive. Why? <laughs> anyway, whatever. Now, uh, what's here? Right, that's where all the Chewbarkers are. There should be a ladder. There is, and it takes all... Right, okay, I'm kind of getting my bearings now. Right, there is going to be two crows. Good, good. Right, oil and... I can't remember why and who to use that on, but if I'm guessing, it could be um, Father Gascoigne. Or the cleric beast. Or both. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Right, I need to collect that. Is there any more there? Okay, careful, careful, careful. Alright, good. Right, there we go. Now what? Okay, guys, we'll try and climb up then. So, just down here is where all the wookies were. So, let's go up here then. I hope this is correct. I, I really do. 
guys, I don't know about you. I'm having so much fun. <laughs> it's so great to uh, come back to this game again. I hope you're enjoying yourselves. All right, what now? Oh, crows. Yep, there you go. Check it out. All right. Sh oh, crap. Let's shoot him. <laughs> I was trying to shoot him out of the air. Okay, there we go. Oh, shit, there's more. Damn, I didn't see them. <laughs> oh, my God. That could have been bad. Oh, my God. I hate them. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Of course. Oh, my God. I nearly fell off the edge. Oh, no. Stairs is stairs. We're okay. We're okay. Oh, my God. Anyway, guys. <laughs> anyway. Right. That's the madman's knowledge in case you missed the one that was down below. Oh, shit. I forgot about this dude. My goodness. All right. Let's take care of him. Give me a second. Can you hear that, by the way? There's a music box playing. Awesome. Now, is there an NPC here? No, there isn't. Wait, it might be behind me. Look at his body just flopping about. Okay, what about here? Wretched outsider. Trying to fool me to open this door. I'm here to deliver a pizza. I'm from Domino's. Piece of shit. Wretched outsider. No, same thing. Okay, fine. Whatever. <laughs> Alright, let's go up. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, guys, I could be wrong. Remember, I've not played this in a while, but I think we've cleared and secured the entire area after this. We killed a pig, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Jesus, I've got such a bad memory. So we killed a pig. Alright, I'm going to shut up now. Can you hear this music? Wait, let me wait until this door um, opens. It's very noisy. All right, you can hear that, right? Anyway, this is going to be relevant for a boss fight. I'm still undecided whether I want to do it. Are you? I don't know your voice, but I know that smell. Are you a hunter? I mean, that is where I look for my mum. Daddy never came back from the hunt, and she went to find him. But now she's gone too. I'm all alone. I'm scared. Guys, that is so effing sad. Look, here's the thing. You can refuse or you can... You know what, guys? I'll shut up. Let's just find girl's mother. Really? Dude, what are you doing? Thank you. My mum wears a red jeweled brooch. It's so big and, and beautiful. You won't miss it. Oh, I mustn't forget. If you find my mum, give her this music box. Very tragic, this is. All right, Hunter, do you want to stand up now? <laughs> Idiot. Okay. It plays one of Daddy's favourite songs. And when Daddy forgets us, we play it for him so he remembers. Mom's so silly when I'm off without it. Guys, can you help me? Uh, anyone really deep into the lore? All right, okay. This is obviously uh, Father Gascoigne. You just heard this girl, right? She said... We play for him whenever he forgets about us. Does that happen often? Is he transforming? How do I say this? Does his wife and his daughter know he's transforming into a beast? I don't know, but it was just a bit weird the way she worded that, you know? Whenever he forgets about us, we play this music. All right, guys, look, all the enemies, in as far as I'm concerned, are all gone. There are a couple of enemies, but that's towards where... The boss is, do I want to fight Father Gascoigne, though? Do I? <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to level up, though. We're actually going to level up. So let's do that. Because I'm not uh, confident fighting. There's also Clerical Beast. I just can't remember if I... Do I want to fight this dude? There's more enemies up here, but they're, you know, whatever's really... <laughs> Guys, I don't know. I'm really confused. Can you give me a moment? Let me just think about it. Yep, 
anyway while i'm thinking <laughs> while i'm thinking all right so what i want to do is read out the uh, well we need to put this in here anyway uh, let's read it a small music box received from a young yarnum girl okay uh plays a song shared by her mother and father inside the lid is a small scrap of paper perhaps an old message two names can be made out however faintly guys viola um and gascoigne oof that's anyway look um you know what let's go after gascoigne why not go after gaza and guys i'm gonna try out the hunter's mark thing let's see if it <laughs> if it is what i think it is do i put it in here guys yeah i think i do okay anyway let me use one use one item i do keep my echoes right all right we'll find out we'll find out hey guys okay echoes yes <laughs> okay excellent all right i'll see you in the hunter's dream Hey guys, check it out. I've not seen you, babe, in over a year. How are you? Hello, good hunter. I am a doll, here in this dream to look after you. Honorable hunter, pursue the echoes of blood, and I will channel them into your strength. You will hunt beasts. And I will be here for you to embolden your sickly spirit. That's awesome. I uh, guys, I, I miss her. Oh my god, you know the more further I'm getting into the game, I, I've just got this big grin on my face. <laughs> I don't know I don't know about you, but um anyway, let's talk to her first and we'll upgrade. Did you speak with German? He was a hunter long, long ago, but now serves only to advise them. He is obscure, unseen in the dreaming world. Still, he stays here, in this dream. Such is his purpose. All right, I think we can keep talking to her, but let's not exhaust the dialogue. Um, I want to kind of space it out. Let's do channel blood echoes. And uh, guys, I can't remember how to do this. Oh, dude, will really you get up? Let the echoes become your strength. Oh. <laughs> She she bowed to me, guys. That's awesome. Let me stand close. Now shut your eyes. Oh, sounds kind of naughty. <laughs> All right, guys. So what do I want first? What do I want? Because I don't remember this. I'm going to be honest with you. I love having stamina. We could increase... Okay, let's do this. What? I have selected it. Oh, I beg your pardon. That's my fault. Okay, so we'll do... F guys, let me do 20. let's do oh can i not do it oh shit guys i'm so sorry i can't remember how this how this all works okay i've got five thousand right give me a sec guys give me a sec right i think that's a maxed blood tinge will increase things like bullets uh basically your gun um damage skill but i don't need skill do i <laughs> guys i'm so sorry i'm just trying to remember how to do all this crap you know um let's leave it here for now let's do a bit of vitality a bit of endurance and yeah a little bit of strength so i don't know if this is right or wrong we'll do one more Okay, 16. Let's just do that, guys. Forgive me. It's been, like I said, over a year. I can't remember everything, guys. I hope I haven't fucked myself, but <laughs> it should be okay. Uh, one more conversation. Ah, the little ones. Inhabitants of the dream. They find hunters like yourself. Worship and serve them. Speak words they do not. But still, aren't they sweet? 
Yeah, they are cute little bastards. And guys, I'm convinced they're the ones who saved us in the cutscene when we signed the contract. You know, the werewolf. Um, I, I reckon they're the ones that saved us. I could be wrong. You tell me. Let me know. Farewell, good hunter. May you find your worth in the waking world. All right. Dude, get up. <laughs> Please get up. Oh, hold on a minute. Do we not get something? Okay, consume insight and ring the beckoning bell to enlist the cooperation of hunters from other worlds. Silencing black. Okay, this is, uh, again, multiplayer, um, I think. Am I right? Uh, what's this? What, what is that? Consume insight and ring the old hunter bell. This is the DLC. Okay, we don't need to worry about this yet. However, I may go to the DLC early. I haven't made up my mind, guys. But I really want the beast cutter. That weapon is is so sick i love that weapon um did i read this i'm so sorry if i have i apologize to escape this dreadful hunter's dream halt the source of the spreading scourge of beasts lest the night carry on forever okay so um i think we can level up our weapon i think or fortify at least make it a bit stronger that's what i'm trying to say right use <clears throat> excuse me use 240 blood echoes and yeah i do want to do this let's do it guys let's do it all right anything else i can do can i further do it all right five bloodstone shards and where is my bloodstone shards oh i've got five guys i have got five should i do it wait hold on i really have wow okay should I do it though? I don't know. What about my gun? Oh my god, I'm so confused. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, one second. Repair? Do I want to do that? What? I, I don't understand. Sorry, what's going on here? Uh guys, let me come out of this. Let me just come out of this. Right. Okay. No, my weapon's fine. Oh, yes, I remember. When you upgrade it, it should fix it as well. <laughs> I think. Okay. Um... All right, guys, this could be a mistake, but I'm going to level it up one more time. It's done. There's nothing more I can do. It's now leveled up to plus two, and hopefully it will give us more strength. It'll hit harder, basically. That's what I'm trying to say okay look um let's move on and uh, we're going to take care of one of the bosses and i think screw it let's just go for father gascoigne let's do that okay i'll see you in central Yarnum, i guess i'll see you there in a minute hey guys okay the reality is hitting me we are actually going to fight father gascoin i'm really shitting my pants but we're going to talk to gilbert one more time across the valley to the east of yarnum you'll find the cathedral ward deep within lies the old main cathedral said to be the source of blood i haven't heard of pale blood but that's your best bet if it's anything to do with unique types of blood <coughs> Wish I could help him, but as you'll find in this game, we can't help anybody. Not really, you know? Now, that little girl, I may as well just tell you guys, if you're new to this, fine, but um, I think you can kind of guess what's going to happen to her. How do I do this again, though? And guys, I need more bullets. Right, let's do that. All right, we can run past these fucks. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, and keep running. Keep going. Come on. Come on, Keanu. You can make it. And here we go. <laughs> See us, suckers. Now, guys, I cannot remember how to fight this bastard. So what I'm going to do is... We'll keep your, your uh, Yusefka's vial thing. We need to take this out. We'll keep that. I don't normally use this, just the music box, but we can use it against Father Gascoigne. And I hope I remember how to actually do it, but... Um, no, I don't want that. I want this. Um, Think, think. Okay, remove that. 
Where is it? I need to read these out to you, but we'll do that towards the end. Let's just try and get through this first. Tiny music box. Okay. Is this correct, though? Well, it better be. I don't know, guys. So, wish me luck. I, my hands are actually shaking. I'm just... Like I said, the reality's hit me now that we have to actually fight this bastard. Hello, you bitches. <laughs> oh, come on, Boulder. Hurry up. Really? Is this what we're doing now? Oh, wow. Okay, you know what? Yeah, I knew it. I knew as soon as I... Okay. Are they dead? No, they're not. Oh, wow. Where are you, where are you going? <laughs> he just abandoned the battle. All right, whatever. Anyway, any health? No. Okay, we got bullets. That's fine. That's okay. Guys, I'm so freaking scared, man. <laughs> I really am. This, this sucks. That's the thing. You know when you become... Or, you know, become a content creator? I mean, obviously, look, it's impossible to not get killed in any of these fights, yeah? But the thing is, there's a lot of pressure you put on yourself. You kind of think, oh, my God, I just don't want to suck, you know? I want to do the best I can. You just get very tense and anxious, and it kind of, you know, affects your um, your performance when you're, you're playing. I hope that makes sense to any of you, and maybe some of you are YouTubers as well, and you can relate, but it is much harder. Do I care about these two? Kinda. Let's... No, don't jump forward! Oh my... God! Stupid bastard. Alright, now I've got to deal with these two as well. Great. Well, I totally cocked that up, didn't I? Okay, guys. Alright. We're just gonna go past because... I don't want to use up my bullets. <laughs> so, anyway. Alright, let's just go. Wish me luck. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. Oh, I got him! I didn't... Oh, damn it. I got him. I didn't know. Oh, my hunter is a dick. I don't want to go forwards. He got me through that. To make a man sick. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm just yoloing. I need to concentrate. Guys, I'm just so scared. <laughs> really oh, you asshole! He got me still. <laughs> Shit. Oh wow. Oh, you kept. Wow, guys. Okay, okay. Oh my god! Seriously, dude. Okay, okay. Oh no! Why? Okay, right, here's what we do. Did it not work? It did work, okay, good. Okay. I'm 
I'm stuck, guys. <laughs> I'm really stuck. Oh, I died! No! Oh, shit! Oh, shit, guys. I actually got stuck at one point. Oh, my God. <laughs> shit. Okay, I'll see you over there, guys. Hey, guys, we're back. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, I need to stay calm. I need to stay calm. We'll be fine. <laughs> we'll be okay. We'll be fine. Oh my god, he just walked through my attack. Oh my god, dude, seriously. Oh, no, I hate this, guys. I hate when he two hands. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, you bitch. Dude. <laughs> what? Oh, guys, he tricked me. He totally tricked me. Oh my god, get up! Okay, okay. Guys, there is a way to cheese him, but I don't want to do that. I want to... Okay, I'll explain afterwards. Let me shut up. I'll explain afterwards. Oh my god. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> I've got a long way to go. Alright, here we go. No, too early. Okay. Alright, good. Okay, okay. No! Wrong way, you bastard. Shit, where is he? Oh my god! Okay. Okay, guys, <laughs> I need to run. We need to get it. No, 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 no. Oh my god! <laughs> Shit! Hey guys, we're back. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Third attempt. I'm running out of bullets, which really sucks. Oh, I moved away! I didn't think I got it and I moved away. Like a coward. I think he's stuck. No, it's not. <laughs> Too good to be true, guys. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, give me a second. Oh, don't do that. Will you stop? Oh, piss off, you arsehole. <laughs> okay. Oh, you piece of shit! Oh! Oh my god, get up, get up! Come on! Okay, I need to put this away, and here we go, here we go. Okay. Again, I did, guys, it unlocks. Got you, bitch! Okay. Okay, last attempt. Oh, no! Oh, no, please. Guys, I can't fucking believe this. Oh, I'm alive! No, I'm alive! I'm alive! I made it! Wait, get up, get up! Come on! No, I'm trapped. I'm stuck. Got some stuck. I can't move. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh 
me. Oh my god. Okay, run. Just run. Run. <laughs> run. Get out of it. Save yourself. I'm out of stamina. Okay. All right. Let's go here. I just need some space. I need space in this relationship. Oh crap, he's right there. Guys, let's go up the stairs actually. Let's go up this way. I can't believe that actually worked. That was just an accident. I panicked and pressed the button back to him. Oh, he's dead! He did it! Yes! Let's go! <laughs> Guys, he fucked me up though. <laughs> he totally fucked me up. I'm not gonna lie to you. Anyway, that's not how you really should fight Father Gascoigne. There is um, another way. Who the hell are you? Oh, whatever. All right. Um, there is a way to cheese him, but I didn't want to play it that way. Um, let me explain. One of the reasons I'm coming back to this amazing game, I'm trying to have that fear again. Do I press this? Light lamp. Okay. Oh, man. Anyway, guys... All right, so basically I wanted to recapture that feeling of terror when you first face Father Gascoigne, you know, so that's that's what I wanted to do and um, I didn't want to cheese him. I know you can stay up the stairs, halfway up the stairs and, you know, light him on fire. Th this is basically the red brooch. So let's read that out real quick. I think, um, how does this work again? I have a feeling it's going to be like um, a gemstone that'll give you more you know strength or whatever but we haven't got a tool for that yet so this is it okay a woman's bright red brooch engraved with the name viola perhaps the jewel is a gift from a hunter used to change into a droplet blood gem that fortifies any weapon with a proper workshop tool various weapons can be fortified however there's one thing does by me having this already does it give me any buffs i don't think it does okay we'll sort out later anyway guys but look we're gonna leave it here man this has been a blast it's so scary i'm not gonna lie to you and it's very fitting we're playing this uh, leading up to halloween you know i'm loving every minute of this and like i said i want to recapture that um you know feeling of being a noob again and i kind of am because i'm trying to re remember everything and relearn how to play the game um you know the mechanics and everything you gotta remember i was playing horizon zero dawn um for the past three months so my brain's still i don't know uh think about how to you know play that instead of a melee uh, game so but anyway this is the key to open uh how do you pronounce this odin odin temple or whatever but guys we're gonna do this um in the next video but i'm loving this i hope you're enjoying yourselves as well guys i, I really am so um you know please say sub so you can see part two and i guess we'll go after cleric beast and we'll explore whatever's up there so that's what we'll do that's the plan hope you enjoyed yourselves guys thank you very much for joining me today and i'll catch you in the next video take care